Hey, thanks so much for joining us today. Man, we have a box opening extraordinaire, courtesy of Zotech Zoe. And I have a special guest all the way from the Zotech Zoe factories in beautiful China. Here's Julie. Hello, everyone. This is Julie from Zoe Zotech. Zoe Zotech. <laughs> yeah, Zotech Zoe. And we'll get into that later, but thanks so much for coming down. Thanks so much for coming to Ottawa, my hometown. Uh, yeah, and that's my first time to come to Ottawa. Yes. And uh, the first time to visit a YouTuber like uh, uh, Darren, which I the first time we met, wow. we met uh, in person. Yes. Yeah. I, I feel honored, honestly. It's, it's great. I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. So Julie, before we uh, do a little box opening here for uh, all the viewers out there, we had some questions uh -huh. that were people One of the wanted. Big questions, most popular questions was, there's some confusion um, with the name itself, Zotec Zoe. Can you just explain that a bit for the viewers? Official website is zotectours.com. And Actually, so we have two brands. Uh, one is Zoe and one is Zotec. Because uh, we, we have registered uh, Zotec in the USA and uh, we in other uh, in other countries, we registered uh, uh, Zoe, like in the UK and other countries. Uh, why we have two different uh, brands? Because just because in certain countries, we are unable to register the, the brand. So that's why. Okay, so there's a bit of politics involved. Yeah, I think so. And uh, I hope people can, uh, yeah. Uh, you can choose Zoe and Zotec. That's that's both us. Okay? <laughs> that's good to know. So it doesn't matter if you're getting Zoe or Zotec, you're still getting the same company. People have yeah. been asking about shielding. Oh, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Uh, we find a lot of multimeters in the um, what we like to call the cheapo zone here uh -huh. on the channel. Don't have shielding. It's a big difference in terms of uh, EMF and all that sort of interference that can affect a test reading. Do you think that's something that we might see more of in the future? Yes, we will. In the future, absolutely, we will do some, uh, we will add the shielding uh, protection. But at this moment, uh, we don't have any just because of uh, the cost consideration. Okay. Before I ask another question, I got to open up this gorgeous meter. Ugh. Well, not the meter, but the box per se. 703S, brand new from you guys. Man, you put a lot of smiles on faces. A lot of people were looking forward to this upgrade, Julie. And I'm so happy you did it. And you did it quickly. I've got to say, Zotec is always quick to the punch when it comes to making uh, new releases. And look at that. We even get a nice carrying case to go with it. Oh, oh yeah. Look at that. Oh, man. Whoa. What is it that makes Zotec test instruments stand out from other brands? Okay, uh, that's a good question. And uh, I think because we are keeping on researching the market to researching how the user function do they need, the, the most uh, useful function do they need. And so uh, keep our uh, product, products higher uh, quality and lower price. And uh, we, oh, we like that. We love high quality, low price. Yeah, and uh, we keep uh, and, and we pr provide the better service. Hundred percent. Okay, we're gonna put on our technical shoes here, and uh, we have another question. This one is from Paul. You know, actually, Paul does a little bit of writing for Keep On Testing on the website. Oh, just some really good uh, electronics, uh, multimeter stuff, and uh, yeah, he's one of our blog writers. So. Wow. This was Paul's question. Uh, now that the data graph and even oscilloscopes integrated into handheld meters. When will we get a curve tracer feature? Yes, we will. We will be adding the curve record recording function, which can be upgraded uh, through the firmware up update software. Right. But the exact time is not yet determined. But I will let you know later. Cool. So it's coming soon. Thanks yeah. Yeah. Your question. Wow, 25,000 counts. Oh man, oscilloscope slash multimeter, 703S, brand new from Zotec. We're gonna have a full review on this soon. I am excited. And I've gotta add, this is a heavy, heavy meter, a heavy multimeter, and that's usually a sign of good things to come. The dial beep. They wanna know if the beeping on dial mode will ever be something they can look forward to with Zotec. 
Oh, yes. I think we will develop some uh, products with the uh, people uh, when you measure diode. Okay. And, uh, but uh, it's not in our plan yet, but we will. Okay. So yeah, like, in the future. So maybe like next week? Oh, uh, no. I'm just kidding. I'm just <laughs> okay. kidding. <laughs> not in the next week. I'm really looking forward to giving this a full review because this meter just looks amazing. Wow. So I have a question actually as well. Mm -hmm. Zotec in general, or Zotec and Zoe, do you plan at some point to branch out uh, into other test instruments? Yes, yes, we do. Uh, actually, now we, we have some uh, like uh, environmental Device? testing okay. and sample the uh, coating thickness uh, gauge. Okay, right, for painting, I think? Yes, and another one is uh, Nima, well, what's the <laughs> <That's laughs> okay. pronounce it? S for the speed. Oh, for the, sp oh, an uh, an for the wind it's speed. It's hard for me. And an 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah an yeah. anemometer. Wow. Yeah, 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 that's... Uh, hey, you it, did well. Yeah, it, it is coming soon, uh, anemometer, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Great, and so you're already doing some other test instruments. Do you think there will be the day where we can see something like an oscilloscope? With from Zotec? Uh, a oscilloscope, you mean the... And, uh, like a full bench scope? Uh, I think so, I mm -hmm. think. Okay, and uh, we've got another question from a user who's asking about firmware bugs. Mm -hmm. So they want to know basically why there's bugs in the firmware. Okay, I think it's common for the new products. We try our best to, to fix all the uh, potential issues before launching new products, but uh, you know, sometimes uh, bugs may show up during use that you didn't, uh, we didn't catch earlier. So I think it's common. And uh, we, we have the firmware update uh, software available on our official website. You can update it. And uh, if there are still some issue, feel free to contact us. And our official website is www.zotechtours.com. There you go. And, and that's the great thing too, because yes, I mean, like you said, bugs are gonna happen. It's inevitable in terms of firmware. There's, yeah. I don't think I've ever known a release of a firmware to come out without a bug. So mm -hmm. this is just part of the evolution, part for the course. Just the fact that you can upgrade your firmware um, is a great, great thing. So you can squash those bugs. Yeah. And uh, yeah, that's excellent. And Julie, just want to say a big thank you for coming down again. I know it's a lot of traveling. It's not easy these days, but uh, I really appreciate it. This is awesome. No, thank you for having me here because that's my I'm my honor to visit uh, Darren in person. Oh, wow. I feel obliged. Uh, I'm a big fan, oh, actually. Thank yeah. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, I'm a big fan of Zotec Zoe as well. Um, I have a question as well, and it has to do with uh, your company in general. Mm -hmm. um, what are your plans moving forward for the uh, 2024, 2025 and beyond? Yeah, we continue to develop and produce new products. I can give you an exclusive preview right here. So we will have uh, a digital multimeter ZT S6 Plus, which oh, achieves wow. automatic switching of uh, AC-DC voltage, resistance, continuity, capacitance, and uh, diode ZTXT, which is a uh, half, a uh, four and a half digit high precision multimeter. Uh, it also has a color screen, rechangeable uh, lithium battery. And another one is DQ02 resistance tester function. Uh, four models are coming soon. Oh wow, great! And you heard it first here on Keep On Testing. Yeah, yeah, that yes. Is so that, awesome. Yes. And we've got the final question for today's box opening. Uh, Julie, a lot of people are asking me about batteries, batteries, mm -hmm. batteries, batteries. Yeah. And a lot of people like the new uh, rechargeable system, mm -hmm. so they don't have to go ahead and buy, you know, double A's or triple A's or nine yeah. volts. Yeah. Um, do you think we'll ever see the day where it's strictly rechargeables only? No, I think maybe we still uh, will go with uh, both. Uh, for some models, we still uh, stick with the uh, original, uh, or, or the normal one. We go with uh, the uh, rechargeable ones. Yeah, it makes sense too. Uh -huh. I don't think you can ever completely negate the good old fashioned battery out of the equation entirely, at least yeah. not in the short term. Uh -huh. So I think it's good to have that, that duality. Yeah. Excellent. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs>
So believe it or not, this wraps up the box opening slash question period with Zotec Zoe. And man, I had a lot of fun. I, I think, I think you had some fun too. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I, I keep laughing here. <laughs> Hey, you got to have a laugh these days. So um, once again, thanks so much for watching. Thanks, uh, Julie, for coming by the studio and uh, sharing your thoughts and insights of giving us some great info about what's up and coming with Zotec Zoe for 2024 and beyond. Mm -hmm. Appreciate it so much. And uh, hey, I really appreciate everything you and Zotec has done. You guys have been great for the test instrument world mm -hmm. and uh, us end users really appreciate what you've done. No, thank you for having me here, uh, Darren. And uh, I, uh, I really appreciate uh, you. You can uh, have me here, and uh, I can have the chance to to talk with you in person, face to face. I I really enjoy the uh, this video, th this video uh, we we record together. And I hope next meeting we will. Uh, meet in our factory, in oh, our yeah. workshop oh, in wow. China. I would love that. Yeah, yeah. We welcome you uh, anytime. You are you are uh, always welcome to oh, China. Man, yeah. that sounds great. And I'll definitely probably take you up on that offer because mm -hmm. uh, I've always been wanting to go and to actually see the Zotec factory. I think you said you have two? Yes. Two yes. factories. Yeah, yeah. We have two. One is at Shenzhen. We, uh, we have been always focused on this. And another one is in our hometown, Guiyang, and we will expand our factory there uh, in this year. And uh, we are hiring. And uh, I welcome people to come to our company. <laughs> there you go, Zotek is hiring. <laughs> Don't be shy. That's Thank excellent. You. Well, thanks so much again. Appreciate it. And you know what we say at the end of everything. And I got to say it. I hope you can say it with me. Just want to say keep, keep on, on testing. testing. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you.